live from Baylor Ballpark. It's day two of the college baseball season. Game two between the Huskers of Nebraska and the Bears of Baylor. Bonners, but uh, throws the ball, fastball, you'll see about 87, 89 miles an hour, and wow. Chick slides into the table setter roll, and he will bring himself home. 2-1 over the right side, a chance to get out of the inning. Lofton to Wexner in time. In terms of uh, how it started, boy, you, you think uh, you're exactly right. You get 11 run lead. As we talked about, there's some challenges there with pitching it with a lead. McKenzie's going to stretch this one to a double. That's a fair ball. And that should bring home the tying run. Lofton looking for an RBI double standing up. It's a brand new ball game. Here comes the payoff pitch from Gomez. It'll have to wait, but he got Mueller leaning. Let's see if Baylor can find any positives here, and the answer is no. Looked to be a, a great inning. First pitch swing in Martinez underneath this one. Backtracking is Haggy. And this should be a good sacrifice fly for Baylor. Gomez out towards right. Polensky is not going to be able to track this one down. Tried to dummy that he had a read on it to hopefully slow down the runners, but with two outs, not a chance. There's second straight year these two teams have met, and a charge in this one, a no-doubter off the bat of Nick Lofton. On that Gomez was able to handle himself. This thing anything but a slow roller. Back-to-back -back bombs for the Bears. Bring him on the grass. Lofton a chopper to the left side. That's going to score one. 3-2 to Roseberry, and this one will give some fits to Esteban. Offering of the day from Dickens. Over to the right side with one out. It'll get through, and Nebraska will get one home. 2-2 to Polinski. This one out towards left, should score at least one. Say towards the wall, it'll score four. It's a grand slam home run off the bat of Aaron Polinski. And we are tied in Waco. In the middle of your shot there in scoring position, ball up the middle. Knocked down by Martinez, chance for two. No further damage done. Daniel Caruso, meet your new best friend. Second straight inning that Mojo Haggy leads off. Wow. Diving catch. <laughs> At uh, flagpole. This one has oh. a chance. Wow. Good bond. Nebraska has completed the comeback. Up the middle, chance for two. Starts with Cam Chick. Four, six, three, and the bases are wiped clean. And a walk on five pitches. And an RBI single in the fifth. This should hang up there. The question is, who gets underneath it? Wow, long run for Jared McKenzie. And that brings up your cleanup spot, Luke Roskam. Runner is going. They got him. Payoff pitch off the mark. It's a leadoff walk for Baylor, who continues to find ways to get their leadoff man on. Pulls back. Looking for that hole on the left side. Tough play for Schwellenbach. Not in time. Wow. How about that? Slider. Right side. Only plays at first. It's a tied ball game for now. Oh, outstanding at bat. Out towards center. Acker's not going to be able to get to this one before it drops down. And that is a lead-off double. A potential game-winning run. This has a chance to get down. It was a slow start off the bag from Thomas. It doesn't matter. Jared McKenzie will touch home. It's a Waco walk-off. For Pat Combs, I'm Lincoln Rose saying so long from Baylor Ballpark in Waco, where the Bears come back to walk it off 8-7 in the 10th inning.